Thousands of people have already downloaded the Notion app in hopes to organize, declutter, and simplify their digital life. But does this app actually help to reduce stress, increase productivity, and create a healthy work-life balance? In today's Notion review, I'll break down its pros, cons, and reveal whether it's a game changer or just another overhyped tool that you'll forget about in a week. So what is Notion and how does it work? Notion is an all-purpose workspace that allows you to take notes and manage projects while having access to an extensive database of features. With these tools, you can create a variety of content, from simple notes and to-do lists to collaborative workspaces and complex databases, all in one easy-to-use platform. Notion works by providing users with a customizable blank slate, where you can then store and organize any information you want. Gone are the days of using a separate app for notes, another for spreadsheets, and another for media because the Notion app does all of that in one convenient location. And though a blank slate may sound intimidating, don't worry, you won't need to start from scratch. Whether you are planning a vacation, a family reunion, or setting a goal, there are more than 30,000 pre-made templates to choose from. Similar to Canva, these were created by community users, so the prices range between free to a small upcharge. Once you've selected your favorite, you can customize it according to your specific needs. All right, the next thing I wanna cover in this Notion review is the ease of use. This is a cloud-based service that can sync across all your devices in one fell swoop. So the project you're editing on your work computer can simultaneously be accessed on your home laptop, tablet, or mobile device. It's available right on the web and can also be downloaded on macOS, Windows, iOS, and Android devices. Another great reason why Notion qualifies as one of the best productivity tools is because it seamlessly integrates with other commonly used apps, such as Google Calendar, Trello, Miro, GitHub, Jira, Slack, Asana, Google Drive, and more. This means you no longer have to search through a ton of tabs on your browser. Of course, this doesn't mean it's going to be the bland black and white spreadsheets that we're all used to either. Notion has plenty of colorful and creative tools so you can design your workspace projects to your personal liking. One drawback I did notice though, is that there can be a steep learning curve for beginners, especially if you don't have previous experience using a productivity app, the abundance of features included in Notion can feel a bit overwhelming. But as I said, there is a pool with thousands of ready to use templates so newbies can simply use one of those until they're comfortable creating their own. So if you're tired of juggling between multiple apps for notes, tasks, and projects, Notion might be exactly what you need. I dropped the link in the description, so feel free to check it out. Now, let's see what kind of features you can expect upon downloading Notion. At the heart of this app is the note-taking feature, which not only comes with detailed text formatting, but also the ability to upload images, videos, and files. As I mentioned earlier, there are customizable templates to suit note-taking needs of any kind. And you really can enjoy personalizing these features without stress thanks to the history feature. This allows users to revert any modifications and restore a previous version, so even if you make a mistake or delete any data, there's always backup on hand. You can even adjust the length of time that password is stored according to your subscription. For me personally, when it comes to organizing things like tasks, contacts, and projects, the database feature was a game changer. There are multiple formats available, including lists, boards, tables, calendars, and galleries, plus powerful filtering and sorting functions for easy organization. What's more, you can efficiently transfer data directly from other apps, like Jira, GitHub, and Asana to make filling out your database super straightforward. Keep in mind though, this feature is unlimited on the premium plans, and the free version allows it only on one specific template. As far as simplifying daily life goes, the project manager is really going to make a difference. With this tool, you can create to-do lists, assign tasks, set deadlines, and track the progress of any project. There's even an option to collaborate with team members on any shared projects. The Kanban boards are a great way to track project progress, and you can even integrate other project management tools as well. Now, the wikis feature allows you to create a central knowledge base relative to any topic, making it handy for you or your team to refer back to when searching for specific information. It allows you to organize data hierarchically in pages and subpages with the ability to easily link and connect related media, plus reusing templates. This process is even easier because of Notion's file keeping feature, which lets you directly upload and store images, 
videos, and files onto the app itself. The free plan has a 5 megabyte limit per file, but if you upgrade to a premium plan, you get unlimited uploads and a 5 gigabyte max per file. For those of you who are using the Notion productivity tools for teamwork, the collaboration feature will really help. This allows for real-time co-editing with multiple users, with the addition of commenting and mentions for smoother communication. Whether you're editing with family, friends, or coworkers, you have the ability to control access and permission for different users. Keep this feature in mind when selecting which subscription you'd like, as the varying tiers let you invite between 10 to more than 100 people. And if you're one of the many people this year who is finally looking to start a new blog, launch your own website, or create a portfolio, then the web publishing feature has you covered. It works on all kinds of websites, with the free version keeping the notion.site domain and the premium giving users the freedom to choose a custom one. The higher up tiers even include advanced SEO, site customizations, and Google integrations. Regardless if you're using Notion for productivity, organization, or motivational purposes, the next feature boosts all of those to another level. The Notion AI tool can be added onto any plan at an additional cost and provides users with the power of highly customized artificial intelligence right at their fingertips. Here are just a few examples of what Notion AI can do. Translate languages and codes, summarize existing content, fix spelling and grammar, brainstorm ideas about any topic you ask, and even write a rough draft for your blog posts or social media captions. All of that is great, but I need to mention one slight con of Notion. Similar to platforms like Google Docs and Canva, it doesn't have an offline mode that lets you work without an internet connection. This wouldn't be ideal for those who are frequently on the go or travel. All in all, whether you're using Notion as a convenient notebook or as a database for all your organization-related needs, this app is certainly useful when it comes to increasing productivity and decreasing daily stress. If you found this video useful so far, let us know in the comments. Or if you have any more questions about what Notion has to offer, feel free to ask below in a comment. Speaking of asking questions, the Notion app itself comes with some great customer support options. The Help Center has lots of articles, guides, and FAQs covering a wide range of topics. There's also email support for any specific inquiries, and the community forum gives users a place to connect, share tips, and answer questions. It's worth noting that priority support is only given to Plus and Upper Plan members. So what plans do Notion offer? There is a free version available, which is a decent way to get familiar with the app. However, it's very limited as far as features and customizations go. Upgrading to either the Plus, Business, or Enterprise options gets you an increasing amount of features and functionalities, so you can select the one that best suits your budget and needs. Overall, the plan with the best price per value goes to the Plus plan. It includes everything in the unpaid option, as well as the ability to invite 100 guests, sync databases with third-party apps, customize websites, automation, dashboards, and more. The AI add-on is also reasonably priced considering how functional it is. So grabbing the Plus plan with the AI bundle is the best way to stay organized, declutter your digital life, and create that ideal work-life balance that we all want. So to summarize today's Notion productivity app review, this tool is a great way to flexibly manage tasks and projects, organize vast amounts of various information, help you clear up free time for self-care, and reduce stress all at once. And if you're ready to give Notion a shot, I've left a link in the description so you can check it out and decide if it's a right tool for your workflow. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.